The Coast Guard has just announced that they're projecting oxygen is going to run out for the five passengers on the missing Titan submersible by tomorrow morning, Thursday at 7.08 a.m. Experts have come forward saying what it's probably like for the five passengers on this missing submersible right now, and it's straight out of a nightmare. This submersible is about the size of a minivan, but it's shaped like a cylinder. So there are no seats on board. There was nowhere to sit at all except on the floor. And they would have their backs up against the rounded edges of the walls. There's only one window right here on the front for people to see out of, and it would be pitch black as it is. There's absolutely nothing to see. Um, their experts are also saying that it is just above freezing down where they are. So it would be extremely cold on board. And they also think that it would be dripping wet from condensation on board this. We know there was only four days of oxygen on board, but they also had no food or water other than the sandwich and bottle of water they brought down with them. The other issue is that there is no bathroom on board this submersible. So apparently the only thing that they bring down to use is a large Ziploc baggie. The search continues today and they have expanded the search area. They are now searching an area that is two times the size of Connecticut and they're going down about two and a half miles. Experts are speculating where the submersible could be and what has happened. One of the theories is that perhaps the sub is caught somewhere on the actual wreckage of the Titanic. This is a photo of the inside of the Titan taken in 2021. As you can see, it's very, very cramped quarters inside. They are sitting on the floor and have to have their backs up against the edges. And again, Coast Guard has announced that they believe the oxygen for the passengers on board the Titan will run out tomorrow morning, Thursday morning at 7.08 a.m. Eastern Time.